Kia ora guys, Bird here. Welcome to episode 23 of Thorncraft 4 add-ons. We're on the research island today because today's going to be a researching episode and in particular we're going to be researching the things about Ikor. So uh, nothing about automagy today, uh, nothing more interesting planned for today. It's a researching episode. <laughs> if those are things that aren't your jam, uh, yeah, go ahead and stop watching the video, come back next time. But for the rest of us... Let's go ahead and have some fun with researching about E-Quarter stuff. So, let's go ahead and enter the Thomic Tinkerer tab and head down towards uh, the Kami area of the research. We've got a couple of things here that we've researched already. We need the E-Quarter basic itself, as well as the basic crafting ingredients E-Quarter cloth and e -quarium, as well as the bottomless pouch, the very first uh, E-Quarter Kami related thing that we've actually made. And it's a pretty dang awesome thing too. <laughs> I think what I want to go ahead and research next is the Equorium wand cap. This is a forbidden research that is minor, so we will be picking up a little bit more warp from this guy, but that should hopefully be alright. It looks to be a very blue research, so probably some instrumentum in there if I had to guess, and sure enough, there it is, along with some Prea Cantatio, Lux, and Metalum. So let's go ahead and get started with this research. I think what I want to do is throw it, put Amanus right here like that, and probably a Wittreus over there like that. I think what I want to do is sort of like, uh, maybe something like this, kind of link those around like that. Yes, so Amanus is going to be, this is going to actually be kind of difficult, isn't it, actually? Uh, yeah, what about Etir? I'm not sure if I can do that. Maybe if I do something like this. It's kind of a little bit wasteful of order door, but let's do that all the same. Um, hmm. uh, maybe not. Maybe we can put Terra right there. It's probably a better one. Let's see if I put that there. Perifordio? That's not going to work. It's too far away for that. Okay, let's see if we can get... I, I think what we'll do is just uh, kind of get this sort of line here going. So the next one we want to put down is probably... Uh, Kongetio might be best there, actually, and then we can go uh, Speritus, like so, and then perhaps Mortus, and maybe Weaktus after that as well. We actually used up all of our Weaktus before for some reason, so now it's not glowy sparking. Hello, Spidey Whiteys, where are they? What the heck are you doing, sir? Get out of town. There we go. <laughs> Anyway, let's continue this researching episode. What the heck? <laughs> right, uh, let's see. We got that right there. Maybe what we can do is sign all. Uh, that's probably not the best one because that only connects to order door. Uh, wing Kloom. Hmm. Uh, maybe. Uh, let's see. Let's keep going. The dragon. So I guess we need to come out of Luke's a bit. So we've got Tenebre right there. Could be a thing. Let's try that out. Then we can go Wakwas. And then maybe Peraditio. Uh, then uh, that won't connect through there though, will it? Uh, maybe what I can do is uh, switch those around, put weak tools here, and then put death there. And then I can connect those two with Peraditio. There we go, that's that one sorted out. Now all I just need to do is connect across here. But weak tools actually connects to Terra, doesn't it? Uh, let's see. Uh, where, where is weak tools? Right there. So yeah, that connects to there via that. Okay. Uh, maybe we can do something with Weetium. I don't think so, that's too far away. Weetium, Weetium. Mm -mm. Just trying to think if we can do it. I don't think we can. Just trying to do the maths. Uh, Tempestas? Panus? No. Preyek and Tatu. I guess we'll have to go uh, Portentia then. So let's put Portentia down here. Now we might want to use Orador down here somewhere, so... Yeah, I think actually Orador Sano actually is probably the best bet for that, now that I think about it. There we go, do that, and then this guy's obviously going to have to then be Ingyis, so let's put that down. And we're already using Kong Yetio, so that actually does not really help us out too much. Alright, uh, let's have a look around for something. A Jerloom? Oh, okay, let's try a Jerloom actually, that'll solve our problem. Uh, let's see. Do that, and there we go. So that's this first one out of the way. Very nice looking. Somewhat like a steam sail, Equorium wand caps. Yes, indeed, I'm sure. Looks like we picked up some uh, regular and permanent warp. I should probably have the 
a sanity check around as well would be a good thing to have. You're at the top of that second gold band right there. Not too good. Perhaps you need to start focusing on the, um, uh, this aspect. Where is it? This kind of this area of Thorncraft over here, perhaps. But we unlocked something new down here in the Kami area, the Wand Camps. That didn't unlock anything new, actually, did it? No. So what does this have to say for itself? You have put Ecorium to its first ever use. By devising wand caps that give you a 30% discount on everything. Now you need to actually put this to any use and create a wand that can store more Vs. Righto, so there you go, that's the Ecorium caps. You actually get two per, which is kind of nice. It takes uh, four Ecor plus uh, one piece of Ecorium and two charged Thormium caps as well as a whopping 100 Primal Vs of each type. <laughs> kind of crazy. Uh, so the Equatorium takes three and, um, and then it takes a further three, right? It takes a further four, so that's a total of seven. I think I only have five left, or no, uh, yeah, I've only got five left, so we'll have to kill another Wither if I want to actually, uh, make this guy right here, something to think about. We have the Feline Amulet, let's go ahead and research this guy next as well. No fighting with cats in the cafeteria, <laughs> okay. Let's get that research note. This is just a basic research. No uh, forbidden research attributed to that. Looks like it takes uh, more tools, cognitio, ordo, and tenebre. So uh, let's get to it. <laughs> let's throw down some wakwas. Uh, uh, Man, brain fart right there. <laughs> throw down some pedaditos. Or maybe. Um, oh no, maybe what I can do is something like uh, spiritus right there. And then I can go. Uh, Sano maybe? No, not, not, not Sano. Um, a weak tooth possibly? Might be a thing. Cognitio. Uh, let's move that along a little bit. That goes Spiritus right there, but we can't use that. So we'll go Ingis right there. And then we have Ordo over here. I think what I'll do with this is do something like uh, Wetreus and Metalum possibly, just to save a few aspects. And then throw Terra in and somehow I connect that up. Terra, Terra, right here. So somehow those will connect. Don't, not sure yet. <laughs> uh, let's move onwards here. Let's see if we can get down some Luke's and Iyer. Would be a good way to link around. Unfortunately, can't bring those two together. I think, no, actually, I think we can. I just can't remember the combo. Yeah, there are a couple of really nice combos that you don't even think about, but once you see them, you're like, oh man, that would have been really nice to use. Can't really use that. Uh, Missis, uh, Missis, uh, I don't think so. Uh, what about, uh, let's see, maybe, what about, okay, Cognitio, we already have using that. Bestia, maybe I can do something like Bestia, uh, Mortus, maybe? I don't think so. Or maybe I can do, okay, we can probably do something like that. That'll connect those two up, that works. And then, uh, each here, actually, yeah. So there. <laughs> It's kind of somehow working out here. It's a little bit strange, but okay, let's keep going. We've got that, and then Umanus, and Cognitio, right? So, but we've got to somehow connect these two trees up. Uh, maybe, maybe I'm thinking about this wrong. Maybe there's something else I can use here. No, that's just going to be Pedidio. Uh, Wolatus, huh. that's an interesting one. I don't think it'll be need to be used here. Uh, Wetium, hmm. Lots of really interesting ways of solving this. Well, actually, I'm not thinking of, of any way to solve this at the moment. <laughs> uh, let's see, Sensu's probably not going to help us here. Uh, Ween Kulum, going to save the day. Here, we just need to rearrange this a little bit. Let's see, Bestia. Let's throw Bestia down here. And then let's throw more tools right here. And then Etia. So there we go, Ween Kulum saving the day once again. Kind of nice, only used one aspect of each type right there. Feline amulet, no fighting with cats in the cafeteria. Not quite sure if I get that, perhaps that's another of these anime references. But okay, what does the feline amulet have to say? It didn't take you long to come to the conclusion that you hated all those times the creepers snuck up on you. I know, right? <laughs> to that end, using the knowledge you have that creepers run away from cats, You've devised an amulet that by simply being carried on you, makes all creepers run in fear of your presence. <laughs> Not only that, 
but they'll be petrified to the point of not gathering enough stoke to explode. Great. It must be worn in your amulet slot to, to take effect. Oh, okay. Hmm, right, so you have to wear it in your amulet slot, but the feline amulet? Oh, I can see there's a little ocelot picture in there. I was wondering what that was. So <laughs> the feline amulet. So in order to make this, it requires a single piece of ecor... Uh, jungle leaves. Oh, damn. I don't actually have jungle leaves. I haven't found a jungle yet, so I don't have coca beans or jungle trees or anything like that. So we can't actually... <laughs> make this here. I think jungle is actually the very last thing that I have to find here in this world. It's kind of a desolate, barren world. Hello! Looks like we've unlocked something new up here. Ecor cloth strapped silverwood wand core. Whoa. Well, that's a mouthful. <laughs> but it sure as heck is. It's a mostly harmless research note, so I'm not too concerned about picking that up. It's another blue one. Probably some instrumentum in there. Yippity doo does. Fairly similar in composition to the last couple of researches that we've done there, game. So let's see if we can do this one. I don't have a whole lot of time today, which is why we're just sort of kind of laying back a bit on the videos, uh, at least right now. So we've got, I think what I'll do is probably put some Tenebrae down, followed by this guy. Maybe take it that way. And I could go put it. Oh, that, no, that probably won't work. Maybe it'll work. We'll do the same trick that we used before. We can we can use this, and then we can go a potentia and yes jerum. That's a good plan. Potentia and yes jerum. If I can find them. Okay, so that's that sorted out. Now we sort of want to head over to this side. I think we'll go Umanus right there. Or maybe I'll actually use Fabrico to save a spot. That's probably a good plan, as any. Oh, we're out of ink, so let's uh, just uh, swap those out, just like so. Fill this guy back up with ink. Just do that on the fly. There we go. So let's see. Okay, so we've got Umandus right there. And probably what I can do is do something like Bestia. And then I can do Weak Tooth. Like so. And then probably put Death right there. Yeah, that works. Now I just need to connect Panus up, so Panus has got Bestia and Inst... Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe I should have looked that up first. Unless something uses Panus, I'm not sure. Let's just quickly check the Thormonomicon and see if anything uses Panus. I was thinking to time in maybe, but I don't think so. Uh, Panus, Panus... Uh, there's the actual Panus right there. Now it's one of those end tier aspects, isn't it? Yeah, so we can't... Uh, use anything with it. It's kind of just a strange little aspect, isn't it? Cloth material and covering. Yeah, you'd think it would be in something like Tutamen, wouldn't you? Alright, so we've got to basically uh, revise this, unfortunately. Uh, perhaps there's another way that we can get over to that Kongitio. Yeah, we can use Kongitio right here and then go uh, through Spiritus. Yeah. So let's get Panos going, so that's going to need to be Bestia. Oh Bestia, how I love you. And so Bestia needs to go, probably to Mortus is probably the best thing actually. So let's pick out some up, just get a few spare right there game. Thank you. And then I can probably do something like Ordo Penumultatio, that's probably what it can do there. Yeah, that's a fairly good plan. Now we just need to hook those up, so yeah, fairly straightforward one. Oh, we're already using Ingus right there, don't try that. I did have the plan, I laid it out just before in my head, why didn't it stick? <laughs> so yeah, there, there we go. Pretty nice, just another nice one. A relatively smoother research here, by the way. So Ecor Cloth Strapped Silverwood Wand Core, what the heck is this thing all about? It sounds like we actually need to make ourselves a new wand, don't we? We've got a little bit of permanent warp out of that. Yeah, it's ticking up there, game. Definitely ticking up. Let's head down into the Echoid area. Hello, we unlocked two new wand folk by the looks of it as well. We got the Shadow Beam, guarded by an old man. Wow. We also got Experience Drain, Environmentally Friendly Vase. Both of those sound absolutely gobsmackingly awesome. <laughs> Oh, hello, there's something new down here as well. Man, new things all over the show. <laughs> so we got the Ecorium Tools. 
The top tier of rat tools. Um, okay. <laughs> and then that, that, that guy's been there discovered for a while. But anyway, let's go ahead and read about this dude and see what it has to say. You have done it. By infusing a silverwood wand core with ecor cloth, you managed to create the ultimate wand core. Oh yeah. <laughs> this core holds an insane amount of 1,000 vase of each type. That is quite a lot there, guy. This will definitely make crafting expensive components a little less stressful. <laughs> you can say that again. Now the question lies. Where will you get all the vase for this? Holy crap. So in order to make this guy, it's actually a really long name, kind of fallen off the screen there. <laughs> so this takes one piece of ecor, uh, two pieces of ecor cloth, two silis mundus and a gas tier, as well as uh, a half a jar of instrumentum and lux, and a hundred preacontatio, as well as the silver rod. And that gets you that. Righto. Uh, Preacontatio, that's actually not going to be too hard to come by. I should have... I think I actually have all of the Essentia for this, and this only, is only going to take uh, three pieces of e quarter, I think. I actually think I have a spare piece of e quarter cloth, or maybe not. I was storing my spare e quarter stuff in here, okay. I'm going to need to make another batch of e quarter cloth. So what was the recipe uh, for the wand caps? Yeah, so, okay, this one takes e quarterium, so I will need to kill the wither... Uh, again, at least once more if I want to make myself a new wand. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, apologies about this episode kind of being uh, a little bit short. That's, that's it, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little bit short on time here. I guess I'll just go ahead and uh, finish off the episode by showing you guys the progress on the uh, the excavation site, the base expansion down here. Oh, Skeletronian. Get out of town. Oh man, pigs down here and kind of wallowing in lava up there. <laughs> yeah, so I've pretty much mined out this whole area here as well. We can see the underneath of the cactus farm right here. Got water glass on the underneath of the sand. And here's where the super boar is. And it looks like the vase relays are on the fritz again. Yeah, so that was pretty much all done this morning. It doesn't actually take all that long to bore out with this student. It takes, you know... 10 minutes top, so it's fairly easy to go ahead and just mine all this out. I also uh, mined out all the stuff up there by hand, which I didn't do over here. I'll have to probably come in with the boar because that's just a whole lot of work right there otherwise. Yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. As I said, a little bit short on time today, unfortunately. I've got to go in tonight and uh, do some work at the old restaurant. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Shot in the cart. Shot through the heart. Don't get copyrighted. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> okay, let's end this episode before we go insane. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching. Kia kaha, and I'll see you in the next episode.